find should be gone now. I'm not afraid anymore. Oh. Oh. If you're a plant, can I water you? Do you feel better if you have water? Thank you. No. I didn't mean to travel. I just mean to take the water off. Oh, now it's so dark for Nico. Hey, I'm gonna go herd some sheep. I'll be right back though, okay? You just hold on to the sun for a while. <sighs> this place is adorable and sad. I guess, like, Nico gets to be the light of hope and stuff. Ooh. This way. Aha! Okay, this must be where I put in the desktop background design. It looks kind of like the light bulb, actually. Okay. Now I can see it, so it's... Boop. Boop, 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 boop. Boop, 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 boop. Boop. Okay. Boop, 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 boop. <gasps> hey! It's Aula! Oh my gosh, the desktop background is so big. It's huge. You saved me! Thank you! I was trapped there for so long! Uh, so, are you Aula? <gasps> you knew my name? Wow, the Messiah really does know everything! How do you know I'm the Messiah if I'm not carrying the sun? Actually, I just met your brother earlier. It is brother! Oh, right! Gosh, Calamus must be so worried. Can you bring me to him? Of course. How do you know I was the messiah? I don't have the sun with me. Your eyes! Huh? They reminded me of the sun! Oh. That's why you're our messiah, right? Well, I... A lot of people back in my home world have eyes like mine. Home world? Yeah. I'm actually from another world, you see. It's a place where the sun is in the sky and not in a tower. Do you like this world too? I... Yeah. Yay! Calamus keeps saying how this world is getting more dangerous by the minute. But that's okay, you're here now. You can make everything better. Yeah. Aula joined your party. Dude. I didn't even realize that was a puzzle. It just kind of followed that step on thing that most puzzles do. Let's go! And then I will return you to Calamus. And then I will herd some sheep. And then I will do some other stuff. Now that the vine doors are open. Oh wait, I just passed Calamus. <laughs> hey, I have your sister, I'm kidnapping her. Praise bring the ransom money to- Calamus! Ola, you're okay. Thank goodness. I was trapped inside this room and it was really scary, but then the messiah saved me. Trapped? In the ruins? Yeah! There was this weird stuff in the door. You know, the floating squares we see next to the ocean sometimes? The stuff you told me to stay away from? What? It, it spread to the ruins now. This isn't good. Don't worry, I didn't touch it. I'm not hurt or anything. Still, if it gets any worse, we might have to find somewhere else to live. What is this? Square stuff, exactly. Squarespace. Bad. Anything that touches them just sort of gets messed up. Whenever you hear people say the world is decaying, that's what they meant. Obviously, you should avoid them too. I will. Anyway, uh, I can't thank you enough for rescuing my sister, Savior. Just call me Nico. Oh gosh, <laughs> would it not be rude to call you by the name? Huh? Why would it be? I mean, I'm just a kid like you guys. Uh, then would you like to visit our house, Nico? 
Absolutely. Yay! Let's go! You forgot your firefly lantern. Oh, shoot. Looks like we can't get past that block. Hm? Seriously? I'll be up ahead! I have literally never thought of that. Kinda get used to all the debris after living here for a while. Come on, our house isn't far from here. <laughs> I wonder if I had found this place earlier, if it was just blocked off by that block. So, uh, welcome to our home! I know it's not much, but feel free to make yourself comfortable. Ah, there it is! Here, we want you to have this. Oh, it's a feather quill pen. I like her hat. Oh, a feather. The edges are glowing yellow. It's a sacred feather from the great prophet. Oh, yeah. She's this old lady our dad used to know. Her feathers glow in the dark and she can see in the future. Gosh, that... Sorry, my desktop background is the the pattern, but like really, really huge. It's kind of messing me up. I want to put windows back over it again. Yeah, there we go. I want to be able to see my clover, though. Okay. Her father glow can glow in the dark and she can see into the future. What? Or something like that. She gave one of her feathers to father before she died. Father wanted to pass this down as an heirloom, although it feels more fitting for you to have it. Uh, are you sure? Totally sure. I think that's what father would have wanted. Thank you. I got a feather. I got a feather. It's good to be home again. Oh, by the way, what happened to the sun? I ran into someone in the ruins. She said she wanted to feel the sun again before she... Oh, you must be talking about maze. <clears throat> I appreciate this game's humor on a level that, that really gets me. Is that her name? She's a powerful plant spirit. She used to protect the Glen. But once the sun died, her health rapidly deteriorated. Oh... I'm glad you were able to find her in time. I think we might be already too late to save her. I know. But I'm glad she got to see the sun again. Is there- Oh, there's three beds! Oh, this must be Owlet's hell. It's a plush toy. That's mine! Our friend gave it to me last year. Oh? Yeah, we ha he has a fox too and she can even talk. What? I know, I thought she was the coolest thing ever. So he got me a fox plush for souls to stay. Oh, that's nice of him. He's the best. It's a bed. More like a mattress. Back room is full of dust and cobwebs. Yep, all the beds are mattresses. And I can't sleep in any of them. Hope the squares don't spread too fast. Good to be home. Boxes. Clover symbol on the cover of this book. Hey, just like... Oh, my book! Gosh, I still need to finish studying it. Oh? My friend gave it to me for souls to stay. He's the one who wrote it, actually. He's also the one who taught me how to read. Oh, I have a few more of his books somewhere. Wait, can you read this? Can you read this? Fireflies! Spoiled food. Oh no, I guess that's what happens when you leave your house for three days. Coals. Cold coals. Jars full of dried moss. Does anybody know how to read this journal? Jar full of worms. It's a book I can't read yet. My friend says he'll teach me when I'm older though. What do you say about Amber? Well, that's a pretty necklace. The robot lady from the Barrens gave it to me. You've been to the Barrens? Yeah, Zeno and I, Xenofire and I came from there, actually. But I thought you came from another world. I just meant we were there first, before we got to the Glen. 
That makes more sense. Tube of water. It's good to be home again. Cool. Tube of water? Feather. It's a pretty feather, isn't it? I hope the squares will spread to- Jesus, boy, get off the squares. Well, thank you all for inviting me into your house, but I think it's time to go now. Thank you, I'll miss you. I'm gonna go herd some sheep. Whoa! Hey! I saw you going to the courtyard, so I thought I'd tag along. Same. We're in the courtyard. It's close! Oh, I should probably take these in soon. What a responsible big brother. Bell! Ball! That's mine! It doesn't bounce around as much as it used to, though. Looks like a flooded basement of some sort. It's flooded all the way down. Oh, what up? It looks like this used to lead somewhere. Yeah, the sacred grounds. It's been a while since we went there. We don't have a way of getting there now, remember? There isn't a boat. None of us can swim. And What's the sacred grounds? It's where our people are buried. Sometimes we go there to visit mom. Well, their grave anyway. Oh. Wait, how do you get there? I thought you said it, there isn't a boat. Oh, our friend helps us. He has some sort of machine that allows him to fly. Sometimes it takes us along. But, like I was about to say, we haven't seen him in a while for a while. I wonder when he'll come back. I wish we could go see mom again. Come on, Alva. Let's go back to the courtyard now. Okay. <sighs> That's really sad. Yep, more water. Is there a bed in the glen? Okay, I found it. Okay. Can I change my desktop background back now? 